and you came up, you in good base, draw the way up, he gets a cross grip. However, okay, and he starts going for this one, right? So first thing I gotta do, if I'm on top and I start feeling him come for the sweep, I, I really personally, I don't like being standing up when he's like this, but if you have to, and you're feeling like you wanna try to, you don't really have much choice now to defend it, bring your knee like heavy on that side, so really favor that side. I can no longer stay straight with him, right? I'm gonna get really weak on this side, especially if he has a strong push that direction. So I'm gonna come here, okay? And I start to fold him, so my knee coming tight to his, his towards his belt, and I'm pulling here, right, with my elbow over the knee, okay? Now if he keeps the grip, maybe I can try to break it, maybe I can push and pull here, and then start to open the guard from here, okay? Once the guard is open, my elbow inside, and start to dig under his, his uh, leg, okay? Maybe I take his lapel and pass it off right here, okay? So we were studying this position earlier this week. This is like a really strong old school pass where his, lim his, his game is really limited, right? Limited options. But Johnny has a really good way to defend this, this position as well. And I often get stuck and, and frustrated in Johnny's guard here. So when I'm passing here, he's able to move his hips away and look at the knee, will slip inside. And then he's able to develop into another kind of open guard. Okay, so if you really try to like study Jiu Jitsu and really understand how is everything happening, his hip has to move for his knee to get inside, right? His hip goes out a little bit and his knee folds inside and now I have this shield in front of my body, right? So, this is how we, this is how we discover Jiu Jitsu a little bit more in depth, right? If I hold his hip here and go double unders and pull his hip towards me, okay, keep it really tight to me, that's gonna make it so this knee won't have the space to bend inside, right? So I'm gonna grab from the outside of the pants and just pull it really close to me, right? Pull into my stomach and my chest, okay? Also keep my elbow tight. From here, my goal is to just sprawl and let that leg go, come into side control, right? Okay, another thing he can do here, he may try to push my elbow up, right? If he can elevate my elbow, then maybe that knee can make space to come inside and make the space to recover, okay? So as I'm stacking him and pulling his hips towards me, okay, there's one more thing I can do here. All right, so as he starts to lift my elbow or, or maybe he's just super flexible, give me a hard time, the hand of the pants can come now under the shoulder and grab right here. Okay, so I'm grabbing collar and anywhere near the collar here under the shoulder, palm up, okay? And I'm gonna keep both those grips really close to me as I continue moving forward. If the legs are really flexible and stay in front of you, maybe you come all the way north south and hit forward. Finish the north south, maybe going for Kimura. Okay. But these grips and, and your, your focus is to lock down on the upper body, this creates some really tough grips for him. Okay. So again, I'm here. I'm gonna make sure that my grip. He's on the outside of the pants, somewhere here, and I'm pulling his hips in towards me to secure this knee, okay? So it's interesting how things work together, right? I keep this close. I'm also working to stack him. Maybe my knee also is working to elevate his hips, okay? To make sure that knee doesn't get inside. Maybe you guys can practice this escape too. Hips come out, knee folds inside. Go ahead, do that one. Oh, this one? Yeah. Knee comes inside and he, gets, he recovers his guard, okay? His other option, push my elbow up. Elbow goes up, he recovers, okay? So if I start to feel his him lifting my elbow and I can't resist that, okay? My other hand comes under, grabs under his shoulder, pulls it in tight, and drives my, my chest into his chest. Okay, my goal is to finish right here. Okay? Good juice, I control. Let's give it a try. One, two, three.